Hello everyone and welcome to this video on site-directed mutagenesis. Today I will explain what is site-directed mutagenesis and how does the method actually work. If you like this video, please consider giving it a like and subscribing to my channel. Also know that you can download these slides as well as a PDF summary explaining the whole method in detail if you support me on Patreon. So what is site-directed mutagenesis? It is a molecular biology technique used to create mutations in DNA. The site-directed mutagenesis method uses a clever primer design in a simple PCR program. Different types of mutations can be created like point mutations, deletions and insertions. So what is the goal of site-directed mutagenesis? Imagine you are studying a protein, so you have in the lab a plasmid DNA encoding for this protein. It can be useful to create mutations in this protein. So first, you have to mutate your plasmid DNA. This can be achieved by site-directed mutagenesis. We can insert a mutation in the plasmid DNA, which will result in a mutated protein. So how do we get this mutation in the plasmid DNA? Well, this can be achieved with site-directed mutagenesis. The site-directed mutagenesis method is a PCR method with a mutant primer. We have our wild-type plasmid DNA and we will perform a PCR with a mutated primer. After PCR, this mutation will have been incorporated in the plasmid DNA. So let's take a look at a little bit more detail. Imagine we have our DNA which encodes for a string of amino acids. If we want to make a mutation, we can design a mutagenesis primer which has one mutation. After PCR, this mutation will have been incorporated in our plasmid DNA, resulting in a mutated amino acid sequence. So what types of mutations can we create using this method? First, we can create point mutations by just changing one nucleotide in the primer. We can also create deletions by excluding a piece of the template DNA in our primer. During the PCR, our template DNA will bend and be excluded from the PCR cycle resulting in a deletion of this part. We can also create insertions by adding a piece of DNA to our primer. After the PCR, this piece will be incorporated in the template DNA. So to recap what is site-directed mutagenesis, it is a molecular biology technique used to create mutations in DNA. It uses clever primer design in a simple PCR program. Different types of mutations can be created like point mutations, deletions and insertions. Please note that you can download these slides as well as the PDF summary from my Patreon. If you like this video, please consider it giving it a like and subscribing to my channel.